What's up, everybody? This is Joe Sif Abraham, your friendly web developer. I got a request asking me to show a specific client how to change the order of their post. So this is uh, secondwindmaui.com. I've been working with him. He just launched his site, and we're just kind of tying some stuff up. But uh, let's just go to this section. and. Um, basically, this is with Divi, but this will work with most like builders. I'm not going to go into so much how to set up, set it up uh, with the builder side, but I will show you how to edit it on the product side. So for um, what he needs to do, what the owner of this business, Kevin, needs to do, is he needs to change the order of these things. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to enable Visual Builder. Up here, this is for Divi. Um, if you don't use Divi, there's probably some other way to, to do this, but it's not necessarily exactly the same. I don't personally use Divi, generally speaking, but I took this project on kind of like halfway through it. So I, I, I don't mind Divi, it's, it's fine. It's just not my uh, number one choice for builders. So here we have, um, in Divi, you have a product category and we're listing everything in that category, right? And what he wants to do, what the owner of the business wants to do is change the way that things are sorted. So for Divi, you sort, you can sort by date. So you'll sort oldest to newest here. So you got to set that up. That's already put on. So we put that on oldest to newest, check. And then we got to make sure we save that. So Divi, just save it and go down here. And then it's saved. I didn't really change anything, but I was just showing you how to do it. Um, zooming in here a little bit so you can see what's going on. But uh, in order to use the oldest to newest, you can reconfigure the publishing time of a specific project. So if you're in WordPress, you go to the project here. Uh, there are other ways to reach the project page, but just for the use of this video, just go to the specific page of the project. Then up here, if you're in WordPress and WooCommerce, you go ahead and click edit product. And then what it's going to bring up is it's going to bring the edit, edit product page. And from here, you can actually change the publishing time of the, uh, the time that the project was published. So in uh, status published up here, where the arrow is, or I'm kind of mousing over, visibility is next. And then there's published here. And this tells you a specific publishing time. So what I'm going to do just for the sake of showing you is I'm going to change this publication date to uh, 2014 or 2003. Let's do that. So I just switch out a zero, excuse me, switch out a zero here, and then we're going to update it. And what that will do is it'll take these, let me close this. It'll take this product, the 2017 RRD Fire V9 race board, and it'll move it to the bottom. Uh, so let's just go ahead and re, uh, let's exit visual builder first. And then as soon as this loads, I'm gonna um, go down. So the product that we moved was the RRD published 2003. Okay, so you see it's at the top now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to change the date to 2019. And what it's going to do is it's going to move it to the bottom. Waiting for it to load. Okay, record here. And see, it moved it right down. Now it's the last product on the second page. And you can kind of just sort them that way. It's kind of like a trick. Oh, wow, some of this stuff is listed actually after that. So that's interesting. That he has stuff that's. So you can tell the owner of the site has been. Um, already editing 
the order of everything, which is good. I'm glad he's working on it. I'm going to go ahead and change it back to what it was, 2013. It was in June. So just so it, I don't mess with, this is a live site that we're doing this on. So. What did I do wrong? June 31st. Oh, maybe that's not an actual day. 2013. Oh, I got to click OK. OK. So now what it's going to do is it's going to take this and move it back to the front. So right now it's on the second page. If I click one here, it's going to move it back to the first page as soon as it loads. So now we're back on the first page here. You can see it moved the product right back. And that is how you can configure the order of your um, products in your store, on your WooCommerce WordPress store. Okay, talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye.